What is going on guys and girls welcome back to EU4 as France we are currently in a war as you can see uh, but it's against the Philipp Philippines basically um, that that's all that we're at war with two nations and we have the support of Castile actually this is Castile's war they called us in and Bavaria is in this war as well now you might be wondering wait why why would Bavaria be over there well look at this they have one two three four uh five six provinces seven seven colonial possessions uh, that's really cool i would have never expected that actually eight they actually have lands right here in the philippines in fact they have an army over here currently there is actually brazil brazil is here uh with ships and with troops we are currently over here fighting together against tondo they've attacked us and the barbarians are sending in an army as well the castilians are here so that's a really big war and yeah tondo itself is at war with majapahit as well so yeah it's uh they're just gonna get eaten basically but yeah i have a province here castile has a province here bavaria has one it's kind of cool i like that actually i like this setup that we have right now but yeah uh, we have uh, gotten a new technology and we've got new infantry as well we now have impulse infantry and i think new cav we have the best cav in the game now i've chosen the latin chasseurs um yeah just because i felt like they were the best and i think we already have no we can still get one better cannon and can we get better infantry yes we can napoleonic square that's what we want to go for but yeah for now uh, let's watch this battle and then i have something else planned once our diplomat is back now that the barbarians have joined this is very easy. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going to move and maybe occupy a province for ourselves. We've got this already and then this. I don't think I'm going to get anything out of this. But, you know, maybe if I'm lucky. And Tor got any economic reforms. Torgot issued his six edicts. Eliminating the forced labor system of building roads. Dissolved the guild system. Lifted all sorts of tariffs and foreign trade controls. And implemented the physio... Pat's favorite policy, a single tax on landowners. Uh, what? Yearly inflation reduction? No. Don't let him reform. Who? Who is this? Is it this guy? No. I don't even know who that is, but uh, yeah, we won't have him reform, obviously. Uh, that's not going to happen. Yeah, so, um, no, we are going to see what happens here. We can capture this ship. Yeah, we have a revolt that just started in the former Sakhalavan capital we do have an army here by the way yeah we have two we have the uh, African army here and then we have the South African army over here uh, because yeah we have so many territories over, over here now we need more troops now without a general here this could be problematic but it seems like we are winning we only have oh my god we have almost no front line but they have almost no back row okay now we have cannons in the front row taking significant damage but we won. And yeah, New Italy, I think, might have conquered some territory right now. Either way, we have successfully defeated the enemies. And then what happened here? Not really. I guess just new new colonies, maybe. Yeah, as you can see, Louisiana is expanding nicely. And even La Plata is now colonizing themselves. As you can see, that's very good to see. I love it. All right, anyway, so let's get back to this here. Okay, we have... Yeah, two provinces under our control. And I guess we could technically go ahead and conquer these. But I think the war will be over by then. This is obviously our French Foreign Legion. And Denmark? Are you at war? You are at war with Pomerania, Poland, and the Papal State. Yeah, by the way, the Papal State also has, like, lands here and here. So, yeah. But Bavaria, man. Bavaria has actually gotten a lot. Mm, Korea got defeated. I'm not sure if I've shown this. And Yamana has a couple of tributaries now. It's really cool. But yeah, so. Uh, I guess we're just going to go back to our own lands. And wait and see what happens next. I think the army has been crushed. So we'll probably... Well, nah, I don't really want to deal with their navy. We'll just stay. It's fine. Um, we'll just stay here for now. And we'll see what happens. Okay, Italy is no longer a valid rival for us. I understand, yeah, and I think, well, we're going to revoke the embargo, obviously, but I will probably need to do something here. I will, actually, that's what I wanted to do when my diplomat is back. I want to declare war on Baden here, 
They're allied to Bavaria, but Bavaria can't join. Ah. If you are allied with the Emperor in a war, I see I can't declare the war. Right. Well, that was my plan, to declare the war while Bavaria couldn't join against us. But, yeah, I think I'm actually going to uh, declare the war on Baden anyways, because I want to cut them down in size. I think we'll have Bohemia on our side, and we'll have to maybe fight Castile. But that's that's actually fine by me, if that happens. And Majapahit has actually fought, well, Zulu and, I know, someone else as well. I don't know what we're waiting for here. Our heir, Titty. I don't know why he, that's his name. Or her name. Her name is Titty, really? Okay, I did not name her. I, yeah. That was Arp the first, for some reason. He thought it was funny. But yeah, anyways. We're rebuilding our forces here slowly. Getting some reinforcements. Awesome. And there is now revolutionaries in Tondo. Uh, actually, I'm going to go over here. Because I might be able to... Grab this away from the rebels. And yeah, we're constantly converting provinces. And I actually want to go for Corsican Sardinia. I want to finish that, uh, converting that first. Oh, well, okay. Uh, Bavaria is faster than we are. Wow. And Castile. They're tag teaming this rebel. Poor rebel. Poor bastard. He's got no chance. Not a slightest chance. Oh, one big thing I should mention though is we are currently. Supporting Yuan Mexico's independence. Now they were at like 67 at some point. They are much lower now. I think it's because Yuan spent some prestige. Let me quickly check. Their prestige is. What? Uh, I can't see their prestige. But yeah, they are. They've been trying to. Oh, they definitely have suppressed Yuan Mexico here, but it slowly rises. It was. At 33, now it's, you know, as I said, going up. So potentially we'll have an independence war here that we can support. I love that. I would like to have some independent nations. Obviously, I don't want my nations to be independent, but I don't think there's really much of a threat there. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit upsetting that um, what I had in mind doesn't work. Um, and it's also upsetting to see Benin basically completely getting... Yeah, getting completely obliterated. I wonder if I ally them right now, if they call me into the war. Um, I would support them, actually. Okay, and you are Mexico, yeah, no longer has us supporting them. That's sad. So what's your liberty desire now? Okay, I don't know. It, it stayed for some time, apparently. It's kind of weird. Um, it didn't stay forever, though. Okay, let's go and convert Cagliari. Then we have converted all of these islands. Perfect. But yeah, I kind of want to help Benin. But I don't think that's going to be possible. I might be too late. Uh, I, I'm thinking about enforcing peace here, if I can. Um, there you go. Let's send a little bit of gold. One of our colonies has finished. Perfect. Uh, I have one over here. And then I'm thinking about... Hmm. Where to colonize next? I did go for the Bahamas. And then... We could just keep on going. Uh, maybe I will. Sure. Let's just uh, develop our African Cape Colony here. There is a war going on. Here. Now, Patans, by the way, is a great power, but um, they might still lose. It's possible. So, can we support Benin here? Can we enforce a peace? That would be great, but it's unlikely to be possible. Uh, I can influence a nation. Yeah, now I can uh, enforce peace, but it might be too late. 25 days, then I can... Ah, oh, it's too late. Rum already took... Well, they didn't take that much. They took only four provinces. That's fine. So I might be able to enforce peace against Sicily here. Um, Italy's in this war too. I'm going to enforce peace. I don't want them to take any lands. 
from Benin. You need to have Benin to have an opinion of your... What? What? Wait, why? What happened? Oh, we were forced to break an alliance, I think. Ah, that was part of the PC. Well, that's shitty. All right, well, then... That's... That's that. <laughs> that was my plan. Rum actually broke the alliance there. What an idiot. So yeah, I can't... I can no longer um, do anything. Yeah. So all this money was in vain. Okay, well, that was my great plan. Why am I losing so much money? I'm making big trade money. Well, my army's expensive, that's for sure. Uh, and, right, I have 50 heavy ships. Let's mothball. What's my navy? Fleet maintenance. Let's mothball this and see how that changes. That changes actually quite a lot. So let's mothball these things as we don't need them right now. That should be good. Okay, so we're back to making money. Good. But yeah, uh, obviously I am, I've built two force, well, I haven't built to the force level, but still I have a sign, like pretty large army. And our navy, I mean, it's pretty good. It's pretty, pretty decent with 50 heavy ships. I think that's, is that one of the largest? I don't know. This is our army. We definitely have one of the largest armies. As for navies, we have, well, the third largest navy. So, you know, I can't believe that Melindy can support 63 heavy ship. How is that possible? This is Melindy. Like five provinces and they have that many heavy ships. I, it doesn't make any sense to me. But yeah, anyway, if this ever ends, we can try something new. Our conquista would just died, which is very sad. Okay, Tarnate actually sending troops. Well, but they will be crushed. And there goes the peace. So we didn't get anything. That's not surprising. Bavaria got all of this. And Castile got something. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine promises to Bavaria. One to Castile. Fine. All right. Now, my plan is to declare war on Baden. We'll have Bohemia not join. Huh. Now, if I do this, I would have to fight Bavaria and all of Bavaria's allies. That's not a good plan because Bavaria has many allies. So I can't do this. I can't do what I had planned. So the HRE has actually grown to now incorporate um, the Papal States as well and Croatia. Hmm. That is not fun. What if I declare war on the Papal States? Yamana will join in. Huh. What if I declare war on Greece? I like the with Bavaria. Bohemia, Castile would join in. As would Bavaria. Hmm. And revolutionaries, urban, urbanist separatists. <sighs> Basically, what I want to do is I want to break up, well, Bohemia, maybe Castile. Uh, I definitely don't want Bohemia to have these lands. I want this to be independent or Italian or something. But I can't quite do this on my own. So what about you? I like to Bavaria. Allied to Holy Roman Emperor. Who else are you allied to? It's just Greece. I have to... I have to do this? Um... Yeah. Here's what I'll have... I'll do this. Uh, then I still won't be able to declare war, right? Well, we'll do it anyway. So I'll declare the war. We can go for... New diplomatic tech. Let's do this. And so, yeah, Bavaria no longer allied to all these fools. And I wonder if I can now declare war. Probably not. But, um, yeah, you guys need to stop 
your drills. Um. Okay, so that's Greece and Bavaria. I want... But I actually want to do something else. I wonder if I can declare war. Uh, you cannot declare one a member if you're already at war with the Emperor. Oh, that's so frustrating. Are you allied to someone else? Mecklenburg and the Papal State? Nope, they're all in, in the thing. Alright, yeah, well, that's the way it is. But I do have a free trader. I just basically, what I want to do is I want to break up the power blocks. That's, that's my main focus. And, um, well, I hope that I'll be successful there. Now, here, transfer trade power. Let's just have this guy over here. It's fine. And I don't think I need Yamana here. Italian revolutionaries seem to be very successful. So, yeah, we'll see. Um... I really don't want to do too much myself. Bavaria does have some holdings that I might be interested in. Um, whoops. Nope. Not interested in that. Extreme Monsoons. Uh, we'll just take the Devastation. I'm not going to pay that much money for it. Uh, we're now trading in Slaves and Ivory. That's very good. Yeah, so let them let those former allies now fight. Italy. Your ally to Sicily. I should be able to declare war on you. Uh, Castile will join. Obviously. Sicily's not gonna join. Hmm. I wanted Sicily to join though. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to promise Castile gains. And I'm going to take Colony North America. Good. I'm just going to go ahead and declare a couple wars because at this point, it's just, it's getting too easy and I, I need to change it up. I need to change it up. Um, now, and when I say too easy, it means I don't want to like conquer everything, right? I just want to break up some of these large blobby nations because they're actually, like some of them are actually a threat. So yeah, we're going to use uh, Castile for this and I still want to be able to do something, you know, about Bohemia and so on and so forth, but we'll see uh, if, that's, if that's a thing. Uh, we'll have them probably, actually at this point it's fine. At this point, I can actually, like, piece them out because all I really wanted was to break up the alliances so I can go to war with Baden and so on and so forth. So that's probably what I will do. Anyway, um, yeah. Now, Castile, I will get, give Castile some of these lands, probably, like, I mean, this will probably just be Navarra. But I need to make sure that I actually uh, have have it under control hmm because if not yeah they're gonna take that themselves bastards truly a bunch of bastards anyway how's it looking here I hope I can cross Well, we are being attacked. Um, they have a lot of cannons. But almost no front line. That apparently does not matter. Oh, I'm gonna get stack wiped. No! Okay, that was bad. It was very bad. The very stronger than I expected with that big army there. Uh, French, the French Foreign Legion just got crushed. Unfortunately. That's okay. And Siena is the capital for some reason. 
Il Bourbon, I want to convert. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, I basically just want to sacrifice a lot of troops, if possible. And... Okay, Colonial Castile. Oh, New Granada has just formed. Interesting. Yeah, I'm leaving Colombia to them. I don't really need it. It's fine. Uh, I guess I'll just take this. Okay, Bohemia is losing lots and lots of troops. And Denmark declared nationalism on Norway. Good, we'll crush you. Should be able to do that in time. Yeah, we lost um, our colonial army, which means they, this one needs to be rebuilt. So let's do that. And then four cav and 10 artillery. I don't even have the money for that. That's surprising. I did not expect that to be an issue. Okay, we have a new... Oh, don't tell me... Okay, no, we're recruiting. Okay. I thought I was using mercenaries again. Okay, Xosa is a real province. Cool. Let's keep colonizing South Africa. All right. Yeah, so we're winning these wars. Right. I want to be over here. Okay, the rebels have been crushed. Feeling good about that. Feeling not so good about this, obviously. Let's send our fleet here. And we'll have to rebuild at some point. Let's go to Aquitaine. Let's go to Siena. So we can basically fight our way through. Okay, Bahamas. Part of the Antilles. Um, and then, you know... I, I could colonize... Could colonize these provinces, but I don't really want to. Because they're tropical and that kind of slows everything down. So I might just go for this one instead. And we have fetishist people. Oh, in Madagascar, which we could export, uh, expel. Hmm. Or Malagasy. Oh, it's the same, yeah. All right, well, we'll just send a colonist. By the way, what is the religious makeup? It's mostly Qatar. Yeah. Cool. All right, so we're here at the capital. Cagliari has been converted. Very good. Um, and then, let's see. What else have I got? Socotra. Sorry, let's go for those. All we can. Okay, there's... Oh, I did not take it. So now, there's a huge Greek army coming. Uh, we do have Castilian West Indies helping us. Enemies rolling in nine. We've got a lot of cannons. We are getting some support. New France is coming as well. 
Yeah, well, they actually took more damage than we did, but it was actually kind of close. Closer than I thought it would be. Alright, let's get together. Can we take the capital? An extra rains. Sienna has fallen. Let's move on. In the meantime, Bohemia is actually taking some damage. That's kind of my hope. I want these nations to take damage in my wars. <laughs> okay, we're trading in wine. I love that. Yeah, now that all these nations are at war, there's a... Uh, well, my PC has a lot to process, apparently. But that's fine. Okay, Joma has fallen. Um, perfect. This is the papal state here with revolutionaries. Let's retake my lands and these these provinces as well. Sicily is fighting Benin still. Um, yeah, well, my plan was to actually now be able to fight Sicily here. I could declare war. Mm, take Tunis. I could just declare war on Sicily right now and only Croatia would join against me. But I don't have anyone helping me. Huh. Do I actually want to be at war with Croatia right now too? Don't, not really. Then again, why not? I mean, I'm not even, like, using most of my troops. Right? So, for example, I have 60,000 men I could send right now, right here, to Castile. Um, and that would probably do the trick. And then I could support Benin in their war. Imperialism. Let's probably do this. Yeah. I know, I know this is crazy, but I I just I just wanna you know protect I, I wanna stop some of these nations from blobbing too much. Um so this is why I'm doing this. And I feel confident that I can do this. Uh if I get declared war upon, then well, things are different, but for now our manpower's looking fine and um we are ahead in tech and we can now actually Go for a new military idea group as well. So I think we're doing fine, all things considered. Um, so yeah, anyways, I'll end it here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.